we're going to keep the fall theme going here, Cheryl, because I mean, it's perfect, right? It is. There are some flavors that just scream fall and it, we're not talking about pumpkin spice. We know everybody likes to talk about that. This morning, we're in the QC Kitchen with Chef Deja Peterson Bragg with Heart and Soul. How are you? I'm great. How are you? Are you ready for fall? I am, definitely. And this <laughs> this scent, tell the folks the scent that is that really is clutch <laughs> for fall. So right now, we have a harvest chicken pot pie going with butternut squash. So we're going to add a little bit of sage in there for that warm fall flavor. All right. <laughs> so first, I want to let you know that you can get the recipe by going to the QC Kitchen app. All you got to do is scan the code. You know, we love to give you that code. So make sure you get out that smartphone and go ahead and join us along as we talk through the ingredients that we're going to use in there. So what do you have going already here, Chef Deja? So right now I have my celery, onions and carrots. I melted some butter and flour. So this is called a roux, the okay. beginning of the roux. So All I'm right. going to add in my chicken broth here. All right. How much chicken broth is that? This is about two cups. OK. So we add in our chicken broth. All and right. We want it to thicken up. Okay, and how long does that typically take? Um, this takes probably about five minutes. All right, so you'll thicken that up and just kind of keep squishing that around there. Right, yeah, so it'll thicken up, and then what we'll do is add in our chicken, our kale, and our butternut squash. All right. Yes. What is it about these flavors, the carrots, the kale, the butternut squash, that is just so synonymous with fall for us? So the butternut squash, I mean, any type of squash, pumpkins, things like that, definitely remind me of fall so I felt like switching out the typical mixed vegetables for the kale and the butternut squash was a great idea. And that's the key we're taking yeah. out the stuff that we would normally see yeah. in a traditional chicken <laughs> pot pie and just giving it that harvest feel which right. is wonderful. Yes. All right so then you go ahead what, what's next we're gonna dump so, that stuff yep. in? Okay. We're gonna add in our chicken. And how much chicken is that? So this is two well this is actually about one and a half cups. Of okay. Chicken. All right so All right. then we're going to add in our kale. All right. And this is a cup of kale. Mm-hmm. And you just shredded that chicken. You cooked the chicken and then just shred it. And you didn't add any seasoning to that chicken, right? Yes. So okay. the gift about this is it's a quick meal. Um, so you can use leftover chicken from home, like if you had some leftover, so it doesn't go to waste. You can use right. rotisserie chicken, you can boil chicken and shred it up. We don't want to waste anything right, right. now. <laughs> so we have cooked kale and then we have our butternut squash, All which right. is also roasted. Mm. So super quick, like I said. Okay. And you um, roasted and cooked the kale just ahead of time and you can do that. Can you do that the night before if you yeah. want it? Okay. You can do that the night before, let it cool down, put it in the fridge and use it for and the next day. All right, it's yep. so good. And then what are these um, seasonings you have here? So this is sage, so mm -hmm. we're gonna add about a teaspoon okay. of sage. Awesome. And then we have pepper. And then you wanna season with salt and pepper to your liking. Okay. So. What is your trick for, you just keep tasting it and just saying, okay, yeah. all right. And then, so until you get it to that spot. Yes. All right. Very good. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Even all the colors yeah. look very <laughs> fallish, right? Right. So this is um, our cool filling. Okay. And so we'll put this in a, so you want to make sure it's completely cooled down. Okay. So once, how long, that's going to cook for how much longer then? So that'll be about five minutes. Five minutes or minutes. And then once, then you take it off, remove it from the heat. Right. And let it till it's cool to the touch. Yes. You okay. want it to cool down before putting it in because we're going to form this pie crust around and you want it to be super easy. Okay. So we'll go ahead and add that into our empty pie shell. All right. Spread it around. Oh, it just yeah. smells so good. <laughs> it is so pretty too, yeah. a work of art. <laughs> I'm gonna take a picture before you put the uh, okay. shell on top. Okay. <laughs> Got it, all right, go ahead. All right, so we just add on our pie crust and then we're just gonna crimp the, the edges. All right. So you really just put a finger in and then add your thumb in. Yep. And so our finished product oh. will be. TV <laughs> magic, is it in there? Yeah, it's in here. Look at you. <laughs> so right. this is what it should look like when it's done. How pretty is that? It is, it is truly a work of culinary art. Thank you. So All this right. is our finished product. Okay. And then can we get in there? Yes. Can I dig in? Yes, you can. Okay, I'm going to take a picture <laughs> here. It looks so good. Um, all right, let me grab a quick fork. Well, we should probably cut it up, though, for Chef Deja so I don't yeah. mess it up. Oh, I have a knife right Oh, here. you got it. Perfect. Yep. All right. Go ahead, and I'm, I'll be ready to eat. Yeah. Mm. 
how do people find you, Chef, if they want to follow you more for more personal recipes? Yeah, so you can go to heartandsoulchef.com. Mm -hmm. That's where we have everything posted. Um, you can find our pictures. You can find our booking information there. All right. We got about 30 seconds. So we're going right. to scoop this out and I'm going to jump in and I'm so excited. <laughs> Uh, this would be perfect, especially with the cooler temperatures dropping tomorrow night. Yes. Okay, here we go. Going in. <laughs> Do you taste the fall flavors? In that here? is perfect. <laughs> Thank Chef you. Deja, that is perfect. <laughs> Thank you so much. You saw the website. You can follow along for more. You can also get this recipe. Yes. You'll be able to see this interview. <laughs> When you go to the QC Kitchen app, make sure you have that downloaded and on your phone. It will be posted there. As soon as this interview is done, we'll get that up there. Okay. But you can get the recipe now on the app as well as on the website. Mm, I'm going to keep eating this.